Hi, how are you doing? Welcome to my channel. My name is Bobby. Sorry. This one is going to be really quick. I just want to talk about my energy. I talk about energy a lot. And like I said, for years I didn't understand it. You don't know you're Harry Potter and you don't have some, you don't have Hagrid come knocking at the door and telling you you're a wizard and you just grow up, right? Can you imagine if Harry Potter, if Hagrid had never came and told Harry Potter he was a wizard and and he just went through life dealing with weird shit and not understanding it. Okay, that's kind of how it was. But I'm starting to understand my power. And I'm very blessed by my lifestyle. My gypsy nomadic lifestyle. I live in my vehicle. <sighs> Self-sufficient, yes, but not really. It's really tough. It's hard, to, it's hard to be comfortable when you're trying to figure out gas and money and where you can stay without getting, you know ticketed or yelled at or whatever, right? But the important thing that I'm able to do when it, when it comes to energy is pull back. Find a parking spot like I am where there's nobody around and nobody's gonna knock on my door and nobody's gonna bug me. I'm just gonna chill right here and that's it. And I don't get fucked with. And I'm able to regenerate my energy, focus on me and not have to actually inter interact with anybody. I did some interaction yesterday, sold a couple paintings and that was all the interaction I wanted to do. I actually was still healing. I was still trying to recharge my energy. But I knew it was a planned meeting and I was going to, you know, make a sale. So I showed up. <clears throat> and then I knew I had to get back. Because this weekend is going to be nice. So I need to, and I got some paintings to rock. So I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to be doing some sales this weekend. Which means I'm going to be parked in a parking lot with a bunch of people all over the place. And I'm going to have to absorb the energy and deal with it. Just because it's part of my, like I said... My art forces me to get out to the public when I'm totally an introvert. So, which is blessings because I enjoy the interactions because I don't have them a lot. So it makes it easy for me to be excited about talking to people because I'm constantly alone. So it's a good thing. So right now I'm recharging my batteries, and a lot of people don't have that luxury of just being able to drive, you know, go, go into the woods and just hang out for a couple of days and just recharge without having to talk to anybody. Not everybody has that kind of lifestyle. Most people have children which is a big responsibility. If you have children, God bless you. I don't care who you are. If I know you or I don't know you, you're awesome. If you are taking care of children and doing a good job, then that is priority one. You know what I mean? You're, you're using your energy in a positive way. You're gonna get feedback with hugs and kisses from the kids and stuff like that, which is kind of what it is. When you get the hugs and kisses from the kids, that's your energy recharging. So understand that and recharge when you can, babe. But if you can't take a vacation, that's our spa day, that's awesome too. But anyways, that's just what I want to talk about real quick was, you know, my, 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 for, my, <clears throat> my being fortunately or unfortunately, you know, in my situation where I'm able to just park somewhere and just not have to deal with people for a couple of days. And like I said, I, part of my job is talking to people or I starve. So I have to get into the thick of it. And when I do, I have to take a couple of days off again. So it's kind of like recharging. Anyway, that's it. I love you. And I hope you liked the painting in the last video. And. Again, I'm sorry for the F-bomb. Anyway, I'll let you go. Okay, bye.